What can the great religions agree upon? Is there a common message that they can give to humanity? There is one key theme, the common denominator of all religions. You have given us, O Lord our God, the Torah of life and love of kindness, righteousness, blessing, compassion, life and peace. May it be good in your eyes to bless all your people at every time, in every hour, with your peace. Today, 生活方式迅速改变所带来的不安定，让我们需要寻找新的平衡，并找回生命的意义。在全球化的时代，宗教需要为人类幸福提供最深的智慧，并关切地球的远地及永续生命的和平。我们知道。The one who created the world also takes care of it. He dwells in every heart and mind. He is a true protector. His creative power and capacity is infinite and incomprehensible. He is as great as he is carefree. O mortal being, meditate upon him. As long as there is breath in your body. Om Doshanti Antarikshagum Shanti Prithibi Shanti Apashanti Oshadhaya Shanti Vanaspataya Shanti Vishwe Deva Shanti Brahma Shanti Sarvam Shanti Shanti Reva Shanti Sama Shanti Redhi O God of hope, enable us to hope in you and in your promise to heal the broken heart, set the oppressed free, and restore and reconcile to yourself all things. The need we have for much deeper reconciliation one with another is possibly the most important item on the world's agenda for peace. We will never get peace in the world unless Islam, Christianity and Judaism are at one in mutual respect, in mutual affirmation. Not identified, identical, but one in the mutual acceptance that it is the one God we worship. O oh God, teach us that tolerance is the highest degree of power and the desire for revenge the first sign of weakness. O oh God, if you deprive us of our property, give us hope. If you grant us with success, give us also the will to overcome defeat. If you take from us the blessings of health, provide us with the blessings of faith. O oh God, if we sin against people, give us the strength of apology. And if people sin against us, give us the strength of forgiveness. O oh God, if we forget Thee, do not forget us. Amen. Adon HaShalom, Melech SheHashalom Shelo, Ose Shalom Uvore Takol. Avinu SheBashamayim, Mekor Kol Abrachot, Our Father in Heaven, Source of all peace. Give us the energy, the inner strength to hold together this eternal flame of peace so that every human being, every child, man and woman, the whole community of life will be together 
with your will, O God, to make this peace embrace all of us at all times. Amen. Om Shanti. I remind myself that in my eternal form I am a being of light, I am a being of peace, quite separate from this physical form that I occupy. And in this awareness of inner peace, I connect with God, the bestower of peace, the ocean of peace. God, with you as my mother, my father, my teacher, my friend, and my guide, I know that peace will become a reality very soon. Om Shanti. Even as a mother protects with her life, her child, her only child, so with a boundless heart, she one cherish all living beings, radiating kindness over the entire world, spreading awards to the skies and the downwards to the depths, outwards and unbounded, free from hatred and ill will. The Hebrew language has two words for strength, koach and gvura. Koach is the strength you need to win a war. Gvura is the courage you need to make peace. Seek peace and pursue it, says the psalm. The prophets of Israel were the first in history to see peace as an ideal. So, for the sake of Israel, for the sake of the Palestinians, for the sake of God and humanity in the future, we pray for peace. With God's help, Bezrat Hashem, Inshallah. <laughs>